Hello and welcome everyone, this is Kalapovich coming to you with another episode of Brawl Tech. One of the coolest treasures that we have gotten recently in the game for sure is the Black Prism. When you cast a spell directly on one of your characters, cast it on all of them. And you know, all know what happens if you go into a spell comp and you get that. But what if you get this early in a non-strictly spell comp? What can you do with it, huh? Watch and find out. Let's go for this one. And this is an amazing start. Some lags on that camera, apparently. Does this never happen? I wouldn't say never. <laughs> hey, there's a moose. A moose on the loose! This is actually more stats. Happens. I don't want to cast this spell. I think I need a new cast of characters, as they kindly put it in the description of uh, of the reroll button. Pay one gold to see a new cast of characters. I'll just go for a huge donkey and one. We could get a summon here or something like a Mad Mim or Evil Witch. Wicked Witch. Or just, you know, nothing. Aha! Long and arduous it was. Hello? 
nice to meet you. I guess a couple of one ones is better than a two two. I wanted to say we're still at 40, but we started on 45, so... Yeah. Fine, I did two to myself. No point in bringing that up anymore. Got any of these? Oh, there's double mummy. That's almost a treasure. And with the roll, we can get a treasure map. Sure, why not? Two mice are a seven, but we don't care about turboing a seven with Horde Dragon because we can eventually get a lot of sevens, all the sevens even, which is getting sixes later in the game. And having a level six treasure on, on four zero by getting a donkey or a mummy would be amazing. For example, we could get a beginning friggin', friggin stone ning and just run away with the game. And thus I roll. No. Okay. Excalibur. Excalibur is anti this. I'm gonna go for Black Prism because it's fun. Yeah. Right, Olsen? There we go, Parenthes. This one is for you. I would like to dedicate this game to you. <laughs> But Caleb, we're never getting this. Hold my coffee. Now mimic. Yeah, now I need to make use of it. Just watch a pro. Or you can watch me. One way or the another. Yeah, I'm going to get this one. Hmm. 
No, come on, give me a spell. Give me a spell? Damn it. No, it can't be had. Oh man. Wait, we... We actually get rid of this. And we can do that. Thank you, Baby Root. Oh, oh, how wonderful. Okay, so this round. Where's Trulop's kiss? Somewhere here, probably. Okay, we're 4 2. <laughs> and we have this for a board. Oh my goodness. Yeah. But so, so, so much sooner. <laughs> Spells are cheaper now, by the way. And all Puff Puffs are getting a buff buff. We didn't even get to crack the pumpkin, damn it. Now they reverted. Oh, wait. Um. Oh, we do have an awoken princess, by the way. Oh, because we transformed her into an awoken one. <laughs> so at least we got that one. What was the princess? Uh, blind mice were, I think, transformed into this one. Attack and health on the shoulder fairies. Yep. Come on. Hmm. Right, Queen's Grace on Awoken Princess, but this is only for this brawl.
Oh yeah, we're taking care of things. No twinning fork. <laughs> Apocalypse mode now. Never getting a spell. Oh wait, we can. That's a level 6 treasure already. What was this? Oh, I know. I know who this one was. Embracing the chaos. It's still, like, very bad. Even worse than that. Well, we are alive, but we need much more than this random thingies. These random thingies. How about Wand of Weirding? Okay. It's slightly better. That is slightly better. Go. Oh, I cast it twice only on one target. I forgot. Damn it. Uh. Oh, they have a Kent Book of Merlin, damn it. I do think Ashwood Elm would be amazing here, even instead of Smurfy Leaves. Hurricane for Baba? No, we have those baby bears. And I'm unsure about Merlin's test. I think we need something better.
this instead of Baba. Then we're not going to cast a spell this round. I am seriously not sure if this is going to be good or not. It is. Another shwoo. No, it's too much. Do we have a monster in here? Nice. Uh, but the question is, can we go for this and these? So I could go something along the lines of double on this. I'm not sure if we can win against Skip. That's great. Now you were supposed to hit the tree. Okay, it's gonna be a draw. Just honestly, not bad. Plus 10 attack to everyone. I think I want to go Lady of the Lake instead of Grumble Gore then. And give her 20 attack. I'm going to go Spellweaver as well. And I mean, we have Aeon, so Aeon is growing her. Isn't Aeon big enough to go in? Um, I would rather have the trees still. Shema Gotra. Ekam Jin Lechi. Good. Very mediocre. Go left. There we go. By Rock Lobster. Uh, for thoughts, yes. 
once on the main on the main uh, character, twice on everything else. We're up against the dwarves now. Yes, kids, yes. Another one of these would be perfect. Mm. Plus four, plus eight. I think I need to look for something else entirely. That was an upgraded shoe. Um, yeah, I'm going to lock for this just in case. So I missed something, but, um, you know, we have a potential for the next round. Just need to yeah, get rid of some of these. Yes, I know it was a shoe, uh, but the RNG here is good enough for us so that we don't need the <laughs> Prism Knighthood even. Okay, that was a really interesting game, although I believe I didn't play it to the fullest of a 4-0 prism. Yes, it was a prism on 4-0, um, but still, 10 better than nice. I'm fine with that.